high heels shoe echoes in the silence of the room. I think I know who they are. That's, that's none of your business, Louisa. Louisa doesn't seem to be offended by my words. Your teammates, am I right? Oh god, yup. <laughs> They're here to visit you. Ah, just don't let them in, okay? I don't want to let them just see me in a really deplorable state, okay? Louisa scoffed at me. That's not my decision to make. Your friends need to see how <laughs> their star player is doing. Yeah, because I'm the star player, you have to take into consideration my reputation is at on the line, you know? So don't let them see me, alright? And besides, seeing them will make you feel much better, trust me. She turns around and plays a hand on the doorknob. Louisa, no! <laughs> okay, okay, let's continue. You cry like a baby, drive. <laughs> Uh, pretend to have a heart attack, definitely. I clutch my chest. <laughs> Louisa, my heart! I'm having a stroke! <laughs> I squirm like a worm. I wiggle my arms and legs. Help me! Louisa sees the truth behind my ridiculous charade. <laughs> that doesn't seem like a heart attack to me. I've seen hundreds already, you cannot fool me. Okay, it's already too funny, I cannot stop laughing. Okay, Louisa opens the door, allowing my teammates to enter. Genius, our oh, bro, we miss you so much. Ah, oh, damn it. Behind them, Louisa smiles and steps out of the room. I sigh. It's not like I have a this choice. Might as well we talk to them. <laughs> um, hey guys, how are you doing? Not so good. Since you got injured, our team hasn't been doing well at practice. We need you back, bro. When are you playing? When are you leaving this place anyway? I think at least six months. I don't know. The doctor said my leg is gonna take a while to heal. That sucks, genius. Get well soon, okay? Yeah, man. Our team is nothing without you. <laughs> you will be able to walk before the tournament. I mean, will you be able to? It's it. It's in six months. I'll do my best to recover, guys. Don't worry. Do you promise? Hope so. Do you promise you are, you are going to be able to play in the tournament? Even if I manage to recover, I don't think I will be able to play because the, the fact that I have lost 6 months worth of training. Um, What should I tell them? I promise, I can't, I can't promise anything. I I can't promise anything, huh? Why not? You'll be... <laughs> you know how things can be very unpredictable, right? The doctor says I might be able to walk in 6 months, but who knows if that's true or not. My team's mates frowns at the same time. Oh man, we thought that you are an optimistic guy. You better than that genius. <laughs> we believe you will be able to walk soon. We believe. <laughs> By the power of the soccer god, <laughs> we believe. <laughs> oh, thank you so much guys. That seems a bit disappointed. I can't blame them. Yep, well we better get going. Coach is gonna be mad if we miss the practice. Tell the old man I miss him. See you all soon. Goodbye genius. And with that my teammates exit the room. Well, speaking about courtesy, they didn't even offer me some chocolates or flowers or something like that. You know when you visit someone in the hospital, you should bring something along, you know. Okay, I sit in silence for a few seconds. Then Louisa enters. What an interesting conversation. Well, you are a troublemaker, you know. Oh ho ho ho. Louisa, have you been listening to our entire have you been listening to us the entire time? You are supposed to work, man. <laughs> Not trying to <laughs> say anything bad, but yep, you have to work instead of just eavesdropping on our conversation. What, me? No, 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 you are wrong. I glared at her. Okay, fine. I had nothing else to do, so I sat outside. Well, you are really a sneaky nurse, okay? You were speaking so loudly that I could hear you through the door. I really think she was snooping. So how does it feel like to talk to your teammates? To be honest, it feels great. I guess I needed to see them after all. Thanks for being so stubborn, Louisa. <laughs> oh, oh, ha ha ha. I've been a nurse for years, genius. I know what's best for patients like you. Is there a way for me to thank her other than saying thank you? Nope. Not gonna suspend um, <laughs> those rubies. But to be honest, of out of the three, I think um, Luza like this is pretty much very nice. Okay, <laughs> should I ask her for a hug? No way, it could be too weird, you know. Ask her for a hug, that would be crazy. You know why? Twenty-seven rubies, I cannot afford that. A hug? Are you insane, genius? That would be weird. And besides, she is pretty busy. I doubt she has time for a hug. Nah, that's bullshit. 
she has time to eavesdrop in our conversation, but she doesn't have time for a hug. So I must be, I must leave you for a while. Some patients are waiting for me. Ah, so sure, go ahead. I'll see you tomorrow then. Goodbye, genius. Luisa exits the room, and I left all by myself. I left. Oh, I'm left with all by myself. I sigh. Luisa is such a sweet person. No wonder all the patients and the nurse loves her. I look around the now empty room. So what should I do now? 